The cafe is a great space. We really love having a church where there's a fantastic facility and coffee on offer ready for us after the services. It's a space we love to come to to catch up with friends. Rob and I are here on a regular basis and we always meet up with a group of people and we enjoy talking about the service that we've just had, things that have been preached, what's challenged us, what we've enjoyed, but also catching up with people about life, how their families are, what's happening through the week. We love supporting people and we love spending time together with our friends, enjoying the cafe and enjoying the coffee. to Emerge Church a number of years ago, we got our welcome packs in the service and we came out for our free drinks. We really appreciated having the cafe and it gave us a great opportunity to meet pastors and to then be connected with other people. We met Kevin and Jackie who were life group leaders and we were able to join a life group and that enabled us to make friends so that we kept coming back every week. As a life group leader now, we understand the importance of what the cafe can do. It's that place of connection. It's that place that we can build relationships with other people, that we can continue friendships that we've had for a long time and also make new friends. It's also a great place to welcome new people. When they come out here with their welcome packs and they're having their drinks, it's a great time to say hi and to make them feel welcome so that they feel that same feeling that we felt when we first came. A place where we can connect with family and we can find friendship and enjoy great coffee as well. Hi Church, it's week three of our Half of the House 2017 and this morning I thought I'd come and speak to you around the theme for 2017 which is sacrifice. God is a genius and uh, He caused it that we would give tithes and we would give offerings. For someone like myself, tithing really isn't a sacrifice, it's what I do, it's a discipline of my life. But when it comes to offerings where I have to give of my free will because I want to give but it's something that God put on my heart, it's a sacrifice, it's, it is a cost to me. And uh, when we talk about half of the house we always talk about giving a week's wages. Now I don't know about you but a week's wages is a sacrifice for me. It's something that I have to really consider and, and think about and when I do that then I've, I've done it as a sacrifice. But sacrifice is really the oil of the kingdom. It's the, it's the petrol of God's kingdom. It's how God redeemed man back to himself by sacrificing Jesus. For God so loved the world that he gave. It's, it's, it's always a sacrifice and through our sacrifice then we always see the goodness and the glory of God. So. I would love it to be that this year you would make a sacrifice in your giving. Understand you're giving to God. It is half of the house. You're giving to the church, but it's a giving to God. So please pray about it and let this year's giving be a sacrifice. Thank you for your giving. Thank you for your sacrifice.